Jessica, TV.com fans will know you are predominantly from Rachel Impact the Rafters, but you're about to hit our screens on Fox 8 in Legends of the Seeker. Yeah. Apparently you're there for two episodes and it's a very different role from Rachel. Yeah. Tell us a bit about it. Um, so I'm playing um, Mistress Denner, who is a very popular character from the books The Sword of Truth uh, by Terry Goodkind. And Denner is what what is known in the Midlands as a Maud Sith, which are these badass bodyguards to the evil king Darkenral. Um, and so she's basically a trained fighting machine with very little uh, human emotion left in her due to quite uh, severe training that these girls go through from when they're very young. Um, she's a really juicy character to play and obviously as, uh, as those episodes unfold we see slightly more human characteristics peeled back um, and yeah, she's just, it was great fun. It was, you know, t a totally different world to the domesticity of Pack to the Rafters. It's like life and death, you know, Midlands situations, wizards, horses, you know, all the rest. It's a bit different to just making a cup of tea and having a chat with mum sometimes. So it, it was really great fun. And um, yeah, I've actually just gotten back from there yesterday. I've just uh, filmed another two episodes for uh, season two. So um, it's bigger and better this year even than last year. I'm really, I'm really proud of it and proud, of, proud to be involved in it. Dad! Dad! What can you tell us about season two? Um, season two uh, is, I think, basically, that from what I've seen, uh, the production value has been amped up. I think it looks fantastic. I think there are a couple of new characters that will come in in season two that will be sort of main character additions to the show, which are really exciting. Um, and I think you basically continue to just follow the journey of Kaylin and Richard, who are the two, two main characters, with their offsider Z played by Bruce Spence, our, our good old Bruce Spence. Um, and, uh, and you just watch sort of their relationship unfold furthermore and watch them grow as characters and they're really lovable characters and um, obviously Denna, Denna comes back. But I can't really say much more than that. <laughs>